Good afternoon and welcome to Port Park, part two, day one. We're here for Friday nights. Then we're gonna go straight over to Creek Freak maybe. I'm presuming that's the one that's gonna get the biggest queue. Robbie looks like it's getting amazing again, apart from Blair Witch and done that one. Right, we're gonna be dark. Oh yeah, that's very should be a I think we should kind of just like wait for Blair Witch to around about eight, nine o'clock. Yeah. Cause then it is proper dark and it's gonna be quality in the dark, you know? So, we're quite disappointed in ways that Fort Park haven't actually done a lot when it comes to um, theming this year like they did last year. I don't know if you can remember oh, on the, the Yeah. The Creek Freak ones. No, no, the uh, Amity. Oh yeah, Terra Amity High. Do, do, be, do, 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 be, do. Oh, I'll meet you around there. Yeah. So, go through the sides quicker than going through the dome. Go straight to Creek Freak because it's the one that's going to get the most queues. Rob has done Creek Freak, Platform 15, Do or Die and Living Nightmare this year. He comes to the maze preview event. Obviously I was at work, so unfortunately I couldn't come to it. So today's my first walk park maze of the year. Obviously last year, throughout the summer, um, Fort Park opened up Saw Alive and Li the Walking Dead Living Nightmare throughout the summer. And this year they haven't done that, which is a bit gutting because there, the quality maze is get, get get you warmed up into the Friday night's, Friday night's season, you know, prepare yourself. So uh, I'm absolutely so excited to get going with the uh, with the mazes out here. Can't wait to be hillbillied, massacred. You know, I, I, I just can't wait. It's going to be such a good day. Well, evening. Come on. We never went out to the car. <laughs> the do or die queue is out out there, you can see it. It is going all the way round, round the back, and coming back out. Oh God. So all of a sudden got busy, obviously the new upload for Fort Park part one, day one, is up on the channel, so make sure you go watch this, well that, <laughs> then this, well, yeah, that, then and this. Then if it. you haven't watched it, stop here, stop now, go back, you should get the build up to it. You'll see, give us a thumbs up, 50 likes, subscribe. Um, You'll see how dead it was this morning. And now all of a sudden it's not, not dead. Um, yeah, do or die. But that could be because it's the first one you come to. I don't know. We don't know how uh, busy it is down at Creek Freak and Platform. But regardless, I want to queue up for Creek Freak. I've done all the other mazes apart from Creek Freak, so. <sighs> Going busy night. So, after about 40 minute wait, we just say, kept breaking down. That is hands down the best scare maze I've ever done. It wasn't scary. It was very, very intense. It was always there, you know, it was very loud. And go check out the grill. Best guy in, in, in Old Town for sure. Yeah, that was sensational, very loud great hillbilly accents you know kept it up the whole way through and that was that was brilliant i can't say how good that actually was um what do you think rob better than the last time you done it that's same yeah oh. well we're now going to do platform 15 which was last year's favorite maze our favorite maze um and yeah we'll see you after oh, creek freak that was so intense that is great right? they really did get that right with them they said it's their best most intense scare maze ever, you know, it's the best, most intense scare maze I've ever done. Um, it wasn't scary, but scare mazes don't scare me. But that was, yeah, it was intense, you just didn't know where to look. Was someone going to jump out of here? Was someone going to jump out there? It was kind of like that, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. it there wasn't very many actors. Um, but that was really good, so thumbs up to Four Park for creating that quality. So, platform 15, here we go. So we're just on platform. Um, I was saying it's... It's definitely a night one. It's a night one, yeah. I, I didn't feel the same for it as I did last year. 
But that's just because it was the day. I think as soon as I get to go on it and it's dark again later, it's going to be completely different. But um, we did get to it right at the end. We come in as the end scene was already being done. So we had to run straight. We got pushed straight out, you know. So it's the same. Shame because we really did miss it. Um, but we're now going to do The Walking Dead. Do or die. <laughs> The Milky Bar Kids Vlogs Maze. Scary. Scary, come on. So, yeah, um, platform. I'd rate Creek Freak 9 out of 10. Just simply because it needed a little couple more actors in there. And the woman at the end holding the chainsaw, she went for my kneecaps. True, for my kneecaps, I'd much prefer to have gone like, higher up, unfortunately, but she went for the knee. I'd rather have gone up here somewhere. Um, so that's the only reason why I could do with a couple more actors in that. It's the reason I didn't rate it 10. Platformer rate it 6. It'll go higher automatically as soon as I do it in the dark. It's just because it was the day. It was that low. Um, well, there was only one actor right until the very end um, in the tunnel. And I think they were coming back off breaks. Because they all come in at once. Um, so there was about six all coming at once. So before that was only one actor in the tunnel. Which isn't good. Um, so the only reason why I'm rating that one a 6 out of 10, just for today, uh, for now. If want to go on it later, it'll be different. Uh, but for now, the walking dead do or not. So um, I'd say it was a little bit better than last year. Still, in my opinion, still one of the weaker, weaker mazes. They've got too much there, with not enough actors, I'd say. It's the same story, not enough actors. But still uh, re relatively weak, a weak maze. What do you think? Yes, I don't know. We said we'd done it in the day first last year, and we said, oh, we'll get better in the dark, and it didn't. <laughs> didn't it's get better again. in the dark. Maybe. We will, yeah, we'll Maybe get tired. I mean, it's not overly busy. We'll go uh, do a living nightmare now, I think. Um, uh, we'll just walk around that way, so I need to go to the toilet anyway. But yeah, no, um, I'm sure it will get slightly better during the dark. It did get slightly better in the dark last year, didn't it? But for me, it was still weak. I don't know. Um, it's lack of actors. Hello. <laughs> Here they come. Well, I'll spin you around. Yeah, I want to play a game. Okay, I'm ripping your throat out. It's good to walk here alone. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, bless him. Same story. No, hardly any actors. Um, same as last year, wasn't it? It's normally such a good maze as well. Don't, don't, get me, don't get me wrong. It's still a very solid maze. But it was like there were so many long stretches where you were walking and you weren't seeing an actor. And... The actors that were in there, all right, we, they don't make us jump at all. But they still got to try for our benefit. May not be for theirs, but for our benefit, we still want them to try scary. That's why we go do scare mazes, you know? We don't just do scare mazes for, for the fun of it, do we? You know? Well, it is for the fun of it because it's, it's for the, well, it is for the fun of it, but it's beyond the point what I'm trying to say, if you know what I mean. Um, what do you want to do now? We've only got one more maze to do. And that doesn't open until six, and we've said we're not going to do that until about seven. We'll have a sit down for a little bit. Yeah. We'll have a little sit down. Um, yeah. We're going to go have a sit down and uh, just a little bit disappointed, really, you know. It's just the same story as it was last year. It's the lack of activity, you know. I think they need to start promoting the need for actors a lot sooner. I don't know if that was a lot sooner this year, but even sooner, you know, get them auditions out. Put more people through the auditions. I know to, you want good quality actors coming through, but what harm does it do having a, just put a few more in? You know, so uh, Fort Park, you need to sort the acting situation out, you know, because... And there's not much theming again. There's still no theming. For the island changes at three o'clock. 
There's no changes at all, apart from the mazes come out. I'm disappointed. Because last year, even though it wasn't overly scary or anything like that, and we thought last year there wasn't much Halloween theming and stuff like that, it's even less this year. And it's, it's disappointing, you know, like they've had two days closed for what? What have they done in those two days? Can you see any changes, Rob? See, Rob can't see anything. So, what do you do? Hopefully, when it gets dark, it will pick up. And there's so many actors on breaks as well. Like, what's that about? It's it's five past five, and the actors are all on breaks. It's pointless sending them on breaks now. So scatter them out. Don't send four of them because we knew we went out some on do or die. They sent, I mean, even on platform, platform six actors come back from their breaks. And then uh, on do or die, four out, four out, four went out, and two come back in. So, got to stop sending them on their breaks so early. Is that, are you giving them their breaks so early for, so for the rest of the night they're fresh and there's a lot more actors? I don't know what, what, what's the plan with that. So we can only tell you later on, but... At the moment, we're not overly impressed. We're very disappointed. So I can tell them that we're disappointed. It's time for the witch, Blair Witch. It's starting to get dark, as you can see. Time we've queued up in the half an hour queue. That's half hour. But it was when I looked. We'll have another looky look. Oh, low in that. Cloud is awful. Literally, don't even have a bar. Nope. I can't tell you, but the last time I looked, it was half an hour. Do or die has been absolutely walking. Should we go do do or, if it's still walking, do do or die quickly, and then by the time we're out of it, it'll definitely be darkish. Whatever. Do or die. Do or die. Uh, it's still walking. It's still absolute walk on. Let's go do do or die. Do that, and hopefully it should. Um, Where's the entrance now? Yeah. Let's go try. Yeah. Spin you around. Yeah. See what they have done? Yeah. They spray painted that white because it used to say Sanctum. Sanctum, if you don't know, used to be the mate. This used to be called Sanctum. And then they kind of rebranded it. Preston man, big up Rogues. That was a lot better. Now that was good. Every single person tried scaring us. Tried. Every single person tried. We got told we smell, we smell good. I told her it was Calvin Klein. She was interested, but she wasn't interested. Um, but no, uh, yeah, that was that was a lot better. That is the best run for I've ever had on the Walking Dead. Still not quite. Nah, it's not dark enough for stealth yet. Yeah. Not quite dark enough for stealth. We're <laughs> calling for a night ride on stealth. We love a night ride on stealth, don't we? Front row dark. Front row dark, there's nothing better. Like we said earlier, in our opinion, oh, go watch your other vlog, like I said. In our opinion though, stealth at night is the best, best ride for a night ride out there in the UK. Obviously we've only done night rides in here, but there's nothing better. Then going up, should we go have a night ride on uh, on stealth? And it never amazes. Never seems to change. It's just always such great quality, you know? Oh, looking over the lights of the beautiful Fort Park, it's just oh, it's lovely. When there was one girl, right? Go on, Rob, do your job. I'll look away. Go on, do your job. <laughs> There's one girl. Oh, no, not. I'm not 100% sure if she knows that the zombies here go rah, rah, not rah, 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 rah. She's trying to roar like a lion, doesn't she? A little bit. Unfortunately. But in the day, some actors still. It's one more actor than they had in there before, I think. You know, it seems like there was a lot more actors in there. We had a nice conversation with one guy. 
he was holding a, a man's head. Well, look, he yeah. I thought it was a girl. I said, she looks pretty. He goes, if not a girl, it's a man. But yes, he's pretty. You know, um, you know he's, he's good. He was good. He was split, they tried splitting me and him up. Do you think it would bother one of us? <laughs> really didn't bother. Oh, 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 oh. Shock, shock right. horror, shock horror. Darren Brown's ghost train is shut down. Is it time, do you think, to call it quits with it? Has it been really a... The money they spent on it. The money they spent on it, do you really think it's worth it? Not really. It's the Yeah. I think maybe call you... goes down the whole lot, no doubt. Yeah, I think it might be time to call you... Cut your losses. Uh, so we're now... Oh, that's all right. Really misread the queue. It's now time to embark on what's advertised as a 30-minute queue for Blair Witch. Now, Blair Witch, we done it on the opening day of Friday Nights last season. We're the third day in. And now we're the third day in. But we done it the first ever day since it was back. Because it had a two year break. I think it was a two year break. But we done it on the first day it was back from uh, having the break. <laughs> and the first day, we didn't think much of it. Now, we went back later on the Friday Nights. Uh, and it was quality. It was one of the best mates here. So, it's always a good sign. Now we're three days in, so it might be uh, a bit different. It might be better than the first day. We don't know. We just hope it is. So, Blair Witch, please impress. I thought you've really upped your game since last year on that. That was incredible. Absolutely incredible. Almost completely different, wasn't it? I had to go by myself. I did too. He, he literally went, no, 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 that way. And then I walked all the way to the end, and then all of a sudden, it was there. In my face, no, 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 it's, it's, oh, no, 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 and he couldn't remember for about two minutes. Oh my god, the group was completely gone. He went, no, it's this way, come with me. And then I had to go through, and um, <coughs> I, I, I think it was a, I think it was a, a shortcut, I think, to catch up with the group in front. And um, and I tell you what, in, I did actually get my jump. Right, Rob, hold it, hold it, hold it. Make sure you hold it steady, I'll show it. But absolutely nowhere to be seen, right? Nowhere to be seen. No bushes for him to come in. Out of nowhere, walked across absolute silence. I went, ah, 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 ah. It was like that, and it did get me, because there was no possible way they was hiding somewhere. But where they were hiding, absolutely no idea. It's completely moved as well, Blair Witch, this year. I still wouldn't say it's as good as Creek Freak, I don't think. I'd actually put that on par. What do you think? I'd go by myself. Oh, it's good. And that actually made Enough. it better for me, going by myself, I think. That's the difference, but because you can go by yourself in that way, because it's kind of self-explanatory the way you've got to go, isn't it? Go, go the way. Exactly. Go Apart from one way, they put me in some shortcut. I don't know which, where that was. We ended up with some push, so. Yeah. So, uh, but that was absolutely quality. I, I, I actually think... I'm going to give it a long shot here. I'm going to say that almost better. I think it's better than Creek So, and I'm going to rate that 10 out of 10. It's definitely a solid line That was a solid, solid maze from the start as well. It's not at the end of the, it's not at the end of the Fright Nights. So for it to be that good straight away, wow. But you've really, you've really impressed me on that one. I was getting a little bit disheartened thinking it was a bit worse than last year. It is worse than last year. 100% is worse than last year. Yeah, but it's not even just the mazes I'm on about. It's it's the whole feel. You just, it's almost like we're on a late night. So it's about 10 to 12, uh, 10, 12, 10 to 10, with no nothing. It's just a 12, 12, 10 to 10 day. Go it. Everyone come to the grill. <laughs> Everyone come to the grill. Get your food from here. Best place on part for food. For a standout mile. We'll come see you in a bit, mate. Right. Yes. Cheers, mate. You listen to her, Jamie. He said subscribe, so you've got to subscribe. Otherwise, he won't save you. He won't save you. So, you've got your word. Yes, so, um, Blair Witch, awesome. For now, I'm actually thinking that's probably one of the better mazes I've ever done. Well, Creek Vic's not really going to change because we're inside, anyway. Yeah. Um, this, but that was quality. Um, so, we're about to now go do platform 15 in the dark, pitch black. See how good it is compared to last year in the dark. Because in the dark last year, this was quality. So we're gonna see how much this has changed. Is it better than it was last year? Is it not as good? Or have my opinions completely changed on it? I don't know. Let me see it. 
Yeah, yeah. yeah so I'm going to spin you around. Obviously, new, new uh, queue line this year for Platform 15. You have to go through the Timber Tug, Timber Tug queue line, and it takes you around the back, as you can see. Timber Dog. Do not go on that if you don't feel well. Do you now? From a reliable source? Um, what is the reliable source? Mayonnaise? Salad cream? I like it's salad cream. <laughs> I mean, not even burger relish, Rob. Could be burger sauce. So you come down, obviously, this ramp. Hold on. But yeah, well. Can you touch the plate here? Can take long? No. Platform 15, 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Let's queue up for it. We've got 20 minutes spare. So we, so we follow. We follow down here. What's that there? This is obviously dead, dead wood. Deadwood Creek last year and Zombie Hunt, as you can see down there. But this is a uh, very intimidating walking down the other day. Yes, yesterday, if you ain't checked in that vlog, after this one, go check out our Monk's Walk one from yesterday for our construction update. Um, but now we're here. And this is going to be quality, whether we've got a weight or not. I think it's going to be great. So we just come off platform in the dark, and I'll tell you what, that was so much better. Psycho actors, weren't it? Absolute psychos. Yeah. They're, they're, oh, the, the groups that they're doing, they're sending in like groups of what, 30? Straight in, five seconds later, send another group in. It's, ca it's catch up, it's twice now we've done platform, we missed the end scene. Because they're sending too many groups in too fast. They need to slow it down, they need to bring it back. Whether it's a big queue or not, because it's ruining it for everyone else. You need to slow the queues down, stop, stop sending them in so quickly, get that end scene perfect, because we're missing it every time. So, uh, you need to sort that out, but uh, other than that, platform was absolutely amazing, you know? So much better. So we're taking away from the mazes, we're gonna go do a couple of rides in the dark. Uh, start, gotta, be, gotta start off with uh, stealth. Sure. Yeah, nemesis. Well, we could do Nemesis if it's right there. Could do Nemesis and then go round to stealth after. Uh, we'll see, won't we? It might be that dead that they're not sent back to you know. Might just because of how quiet it is, but. 500 people in the park. 500 people in the park. All park, 500 people. Wow. I'm not fan, still busy in that time when it caned it down on the brain. 121 people. 121 people. We were in here with one day. It looked like we were 31 there, right? Yeah, well, it generally did because they were so scattered around in different queue lines. It didn't, it didn't look like anyone was there at all. So. <coughs> Why weren't you to detonate in the dark? <clears throat> no. No, we were going to try and do every, every ride in the dark, but yeah. I'd rather just get some night coasters done. Um, seems more like a, a liable thing because we haven't done that yet. We haven't done a single road in the dark yet, so. It's time to do it. It's time to do it. We'll do an air, half hour's worth of rides. We've probably got on those. This is working. Probably go on a few coasters in half an hour, 40 minutes, and go back and do a couple more mazes. You never know. We might just accidentally come across and complete the F5 minutes. We might accidentally complete the uh, Fears and Five Challenge. Feared Five. Might be four minutes. It'd be an accident. Well, you say that, we done four we done four coasters earlier and 55. That's not it, that's random in the shop in it. I might just go. You're there, are you? No, it's not. It's in Nemesis shop in it. Yeah, I am. You 
spinning around, you can see the uh, volcano. Oh, mate, you hey, then. Look at this theme, lovely rock work. Beautiful rock work. Yeah, right. It's a great themed ride. Oh, puddles everywhere. So there's puddles everywhere. Oh, smoke and a haze. Smoke and a haze, stealth and a haze. Definitely time for a stealth soon. Up and then let's just make our way around the stealth. That's for sure. Hold on, what's this going? Everyone's waiting for front row. Two, four, one car. One car, alright, we'll go front row. I always forget this for me. I mean, look how quiet this is. We don't really like going at front row, but we might as well as we can. So we're there. Uh, you looking excited? Are you getting excited for front row? No. So, Rob, what do you think? That's probably the better run I've ever had on it. That was on the front row, the in front. the dark. Front row in the dark. It's had a lot of time to warm up throughout the day, and that was quality. Um, I'd actually say that was probably one, one of the better runs as well. So, uh, good job. We said, I said to you earlier, I could almost put money on it, being better throughout the day, and it definitely has. Come off eyes, watering, that's quality. Yeah. So now stealth time. Stealth time. We've got to be stealthy walking over there. <laughs> got to be stealthy. Get in there. Get in the old Blair Witch team screaming and shouting in the woods. <laughs> of course it does. They can't see me, so I'm going to. They can hear them from the water. That one cares. It's quality. That one cares. You're just me, mate. That one cares. Yes, mate. Just because you don't care, mate. I mean, no one else don't care. Oh, okay. He's so mate. Give Rob a thumbs up for being mate. No one cares. Give us a thumbs up on that. Uh, give us a thumbs up on that video. Uh, because Rob was mean to me. So, stealth in the dark. Are you excited for it? No, front row, has to front row. What's the time now? Oh, by the way, this is the longest time I've ever been in a park this year. It's quarter to nine. Start first. Well, 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11
Yeah, well, it does throughout the day. That was intense on the front row. That B&M Raw is absolutely stunning. It's a stunning roller coaster, you know. It's for 15 years old, I believe it is. They're still looking in good tack. They're still riding really well. And in my personal opinion, huh? was it 2006 or was it 2004? No, that's Nemesis. Nemesis was 1996, it was the same year as my sister. Pretty sure. It's 25 years old. No, 1994. 1994, no, because it's 25 years old. I think it was just two years after. No, because it's just four years after Colossus, and Colossus came in 2000. Sure? Yes, I'm sure. Go on then. I know, right? And if he's wrong, he's got to eat his hat. I will eat my hat if I'm wrong. Because I'm 100% I'm sure Colossus comes to Fort Park in 2000, and. Nemesis Inferno comes to Fort Park in 2004. I'm sure. Sure of it. If not, it'll be in his hat. On, on camera. Ten years after, it was ten years, ten years after Nemesis, I'm sure. It's ten years younger. I'm sure it is. But I can't be certain. If not, you'll be in your hat. Pretty sure. So, stealth, front row, in the dark. Like I said, our opinion, best front row coaster around. In the dark. Best coaster in the dark, best coaster in the dark front row. You know what I'm saying, let's go. You look tasty. Do I? Yeah. What do I look like? I mean, if you're gonna go on that, your blood's gonna be pumping so much, you're gonna be easy kills. Am I? You are gonna I'll be easy I'll tell you what, easy. I'll come back to you straight after stealth. Oh, please do. I will. I'll hold you to it. So I've gotta go, look at that. I've gotta go get, get eaten. Five right, minutes, so I've gotta go get eaten after this. That was, uh, that oh, was yeah. When was Nemesis made? Uh, it was made in 2003. But I'm pretty sure it's been in operation since 2004. No, it's you only saw that. <laughs> what? Is that built or operating since? Oh, give me my phone. Now. I'll go on the most reliable start in the world. Oh, you're joking me. Ow! Uh -uh. RCDB it. Of course there's nothing called Nemesis Inferno. Oh, so what? Right, I'll go get my bag in. Just want to just go back right? Yeah. We are a caring community here in Amity. As it's homecoming tonight, we want everyone to be safe, even though there's mass carnage. With that in mind, here's a message from Amity High's Principal Wardley. So, back row. back row, we couldn't get front row, it's down to one train, which they probably all are to be fair. Um, back row, back hurts from back row, so don't go on back if you've got a bad back, so back, go on front if you've got a bad back, back if don't go back if you've got a bad back. You go, well, I'm rather blind, you get the idea. Don't go back if you've got a bad back. Go back if you don't. <laughs> well, I'll go to this one. God's sake. 
Why are you recording that? <laughs> Stop. Hold up. Mid love. I'm out. Oh, God's sake. Right. <laughs> Swarm done. Two goes. One front, one middle. Lovely. Lovely old jubbly that, wasn't it? Good ride. You do love it. I love it. You all right? Hello. Subscribe to Theme Park Days on YouTube. Already do. Oh, do you now? I'm on Twitter. I told you a few times about the day. <laughs> ah. ah, was that you? <laughs> uh, you joined us for that then? Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. People, you've got to remember that. We'll do that. We get a full train. Well, train, boat, car. What do you call it? It's called a if we get a full submarine, if we get a full submarine, uh, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll, go, we'll do tidal wave Let's all day long. clarify one thing. What is that in that bag? <laughs> Please leave a comment below. Right, hold on. We've got out. our theories about what's in this bag. We can't say. We can't say what it is, right? Go with Kel. You probably get this, because you can say it, right? <laughs> <laughs> You look closely at the face. It's mouth open. <laughs> it's mouth is wide it's open. It's wide open. <laughs> <laughs> so what do they use in the saw bags? Because they're very light as well. <laughs> they're very light. They're blowing around in the wind. Almost like you, someone's blown it up. <laughs> right, we'll come, we're going to find something to do. We'll see. It's that time. That's a cold car. You know what time it is? <laughs> Two minutes past ten. What a day. <laughs> the hardest part of a man's life is leaving for a What a day though, no queues. No queues. When we like tomorrow, you know that, don't you, Rob? Yeah, I'd be an hour queuing this out. Yeah. No queues. The longest we waited was half an hour for any ride today. Um, been an absolutely great day, you know. One ride. And that was just one. Could have broke down. Because it broke down, that was Creek Freak. Because it broke down twice, didn't it? it broke down twice. Other than that, it's been such a good day. Oh, we waited about 20 minutes to class this earlier. That's because that broke down. Because that broke down. You know, it, it's just, well, it didn't break down, it was just there to assist the guests, they call it. Um, but. It was too tall. Okay, so we're going to have some pros and cons. Rob, do you want to go first? Oh, we'll do that. We're going to go live. We're going to go live, but right. quick, do you want to see some quick pros and cons on it? We're going to do a reaction, full reaction video anyway. We're going to do the full reaction video on our YouTube, probably tomorrow night. Well, pros was there's no queues. Pros was there was no queues. Cons are still broken down rides. Yeah, but what about the mazes and Fright Nights itself? It's not advertising. Hardly any things placed around. It's almost, it's almost like it is. It's a 12 hour day. With a few mazes in it, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, so there are Rob's pros and cons. Mine, mine are almost the same. The, the pros with the mazes were great this year, apart from Living oh, Nightmare. Good. Living, I mean, even Do or Die, I actually enjoyed the last run through we done. You can't really see me because it's dark. Oh, it's good. I, I'd say, no, it was the best run I've ever had on it. Still weren't good though. It was all right. But that's just the opinion on it. Um, I think it's just too big of a space with not enough actors in it. Uh, that's that's my. There's zombies in there. They need to put some 10, 15 zombies. But there isn't really zombies in there. Oh, hold well on. Preston might be outside. Preston might be. Here. Oh, hello. We'll have a zombie action. Zombie action. Have a little bit of zombie action. Okay. Lovely zombie action there. So yeah, um, the mazes were a good standard today. Living Nightmare was a bit of a disappointment because of the, the lack of actors in there. There was about four actors in there, would you say, if yeah. that? About four actors, if that. So that isn't good enough. That isn't good enough. Um, obviously, con, same as Rob. There isn't enough. There isn't Last enough year, for Fright Nights. When you come over the bridge, there was loads of tombs, tents put up. Yeah. Dead bodies. The, the, the fog lights, they're flood lights. Ain't got one this year. No, it's just. On the side as well, we did see quantum getting tested. We did see quantum getting tested. But maybe tomorrow. You never know. I doubt it, but you never know. 
Um, yeah, it's almost just like we said. It's like it's just a normal like last year with Love Island Lakes, right? It's like it's just a 12-hour day with mazes there. There is there isn't much for Fright Nights at all, and I hope that changes towards the end of Fright Nights because if it doesn't, this is going to probably go down as one of the worst Fright Nights. I don't know, the mazes keep the, mazes, the going. The mazes keep the front going, but it's not all about the mazes that makes a fright night. Yeah. You're supposed to feel scared most places you go. You know, last year they said, nowhere is safe. All right, everywhere was safe and all that. And there weren't that many Roman actors. The only Roman actors here now I mean, are the Terror, Terror Ami High. You know, that is it. That is the only Roman actors there are here. It's disappointing because we look forward to this to, to these events. Not just we, we, everyone. Does. Everyone does, you know. It rubs right. It's not just us. Everyone does. Everyone looks forward to, to Friday Halloween nights. Season. Halloween is the best time of the year for me. Probably for Rob as well. Halloween is simply amazing. It's the best time. The, the whole atmosphere you get from Halloween. I mean, this is creepy music, yeah. Where was it? <laughs> but that's it now. Where was it the rest of the, where was it for the rest of the? Three o'clock, no chain going on. Exactly. Where was it for the next f last five hours? There's nothing down here. There isn't, there's Past absolutely there. nothing. You know, you've got a little bit down there, which they had from the Walking Dead, okay, no, year of the Walking Dead last year, you know, the safe zone, and the, the, with the barbed wires. But that is it. There is nothing special about this year's Fright Nights in terms of theming. It's almost like they haven't bothered to theme it, they've just worked on the mazes, that's it. And what they have worked on in their defence is pretty good. Yeah. The mazes, I mean, Creek Freak's brilliant. And you got the new improved Blair Witch. Yeah, and talking about Creek Freak, we did do it one more time and it did clarify it's still the best maze here, in my opinion. Um, I thought it was great to see Command. Blair Witch. It actually seemed, did seem darker still. Yeah. I know it's inside, but it did seem darker. Um, it was good to be noticed today by the, uh, I can't think of her name though, the young lady who we saw by Swarm. So if you're watching this, it was nice to see you. Nice to meet you in person. Keep watching. Keep watching us. Keep, please keep watching us. I so we will do the tidal wave. We will do, hang on, Rob, wrap it up on it. We will do the tidal wave probably next year. Um, we'll go and get a full submarine full, as we call it. Sorry. Right, so we'll call it here. So this is the end of part two, day one, here at Fort Parks Fright Nights. Bit of a disappointment, but a bit of a, on, we end it on high, but Fort, you do need to work on your theme in a little bit. Um, so we're here at Fort Park, we are theme park days, and we are out.